studying architecture and most of my teachers are men and almost all of the famous architects that we're learning of the work and, and studying every day are also white men and it's very hard for I think me and a lot of other women to to find someone to identify with and to look up to to realize that this is also somewhere that we can be and someone that we can become. I work in a fintech as a product manager in the area of financial crime prevention, an area that is mainly dominated by men, so most of my colleagues are men. And throughout my career, one observation that I made is that when you're surrounded by men as a woman, you instantly become compared to men and their behavior. The science sector it can be particularly challenging for women, uh, primarily because before women wouldn't be allowed in it and now um, they're often undervalued or um, under-recognized and much of that is goes overlooked now. Women and men enter the workplace in a very equal numbers. Uh, women still fall behind in promotions from the very first step of the management later and this is the challenge that I have faced. EVP aims to be representative and accessible, but unfortunately we can't always avoid replicating some of the inequality structures that are there out in the society. So we should continue encouraging our members to be self-critical so that each and every member takes personal responsibility in fighting sexism and discrimination. Feminism today is an energy that can connect people no matter their gender to achieve compassion, support, confidence and empowerment within society. To all the young women out there, you're in the process of shaping who you are and of reaching the full possession of yourself. Remember, do not underestimate your abilities, own your own success and negotiate to have your value recognized. Stand up for yourself and fight for what you believe in, but also build each other up and support other girls, because the only way that we can win this is together. We all have our place and we're all equals um, in terms of confidence and, and everything. You can also become someone very inspiring and someone that people can look up to. My female role models are actually those women from our daily lives, those who act confidently, who voice their opinion, who step up. You're brave, you're amazing, you're powerful. You don't need to behave like a man to be successful in an environment dominated by men. Don't let people who give you such feedbacks to be not constructive push them to be as objective and as precise as possible. Never give up on yourself, because there will be a lot of people trying to bring you down, but that is always one more reason to get up every day and do what you really want to do. Happy International Women's Day.